Hi everybody, Pager here for PG's Continuing Journey Channel. There we go. Oh man, I am just doing a little regrouping here. You know how you know how everything of the day goes great for the moment I run into a challenge that I wasn't as my former religious police would say. A test that I was, when life was testing me when I was not prepared to take it, I got, I get very furious very quickly. You know, I'm just regrouping from a long, another long train ride home. You now, going home, you no, know, I went to Target pick up a couple of things, but after that, I started hopping on my train home, only to, re only to realize that it was crowded. It was extremely crowded. And some of the passenger tours like very aggressive. And I, 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 I was so nervous getting in there. And because it was extremely crowded. By the time I got up, I thought I was on the far rockway down A train, only to find out that I was on the wrong train. I was on the Luffets. So I had to get off at the very next stop and transfer from my handbound A-train, then transfer back to my handbound A-train at Rockaway Boulevard. I can't tell you how at that moment I was extremely freaking pissed with myself. I can't, my mood, I'm telling you, my mood changed very quickly. I went to feeling great. To feeling life happening better not mess with me at that moment. And sadly, a far rock, uh, rockway park came next. So I had to get on that to Broad Channel, and I was cursing up a storm because that's how extremely angry I was. Not only with myself, but with everything that went wrong in my train ride home. I'm like, life happening better not mess with me today. So, another then another Rockaway Park bound entry, train, and then at long last, by 6 o'clock, when I could have gotten um, my dinner and this, this, and that done, a far Rockaway bound shows up at last. I was tired, I, I was extremely stressed out, I was tired, I was not in a good mood, but I still stuck the plan, even if I went over my carry intake by, by the, the decaf coffee that I have for dessert. As I mentioned, I went to Target to restock a bunch of good things before the train ride home. It seems like the last couple of Mondays has been, it's been a long day. I have to recover from it. And again, from when I'm going through a test that I don't deserve to be going through, and I don't want to deal with this shit. It can take anywhere from a few hours to... For me, it takes a couple of days to recover. I'm one who does not recover that easily. You look at the trauma that... You look at that... The stampede that happened to me two years ago. I, a lot of... You think I would be completely over it, but I'm not. Because every time I get in the train, I get very nervous. Now, everything that I've been through in my life... Growing up as an obese child, that takes years. For me, that takes years to recover. Gaining 60 pounds during COVID. Gain, still not being able to fit in my pre-pandemic wardrobe right now. I don't recover from that. I never recover. I'm not, I feel like I'm one of the few people who hasn't recovered from the pandemic. Because I'm still angry at myself. I'm still carrying 60 pounds. I'm still going to lose. And everything that went wrong in my train ride home today. I'm freaking furious. I'm furious and a half. Well, I'm going to do five minutes on the bike. Go to bed early and uh, I'll talk to you later. And hopefully my mood will improve. And hopefully things will go better. But I just needed to take this moment to rent. You know what I'm saying? I'll see you later.